All right, we are recording. Hello, YouTube. Welcome uh, to Wolf Among Us episode four. Uh, guys, say hello to YouTube. Um, yeah, we uh, we're gonna be playing episode four. And for those who did who uh, who ha uh, would stick around, uh, I'm gonna be playing episode five later on. So you're gonna see the same person. It's not recorded on a separate day. It's gonna be immediately after I take a five minute break. One lead character in Wolf. One really care than Wolf. Oh yeah, what's Wolf? Wolf Among Us. Who? Who is one of the lead characters? Is it the is it the uh, shower? Is it the, the, the dad is actually one of the main characters? <laughs> if the dad is one of the main characters, man, oh my god! If they make a DLC where the dad is one of the main characters, that'd be funny. Yes, I agree. Um. I, no, it wasn't a lead character, technically. Was it Faith? If you, if you talk about Faith, then yes, Faith is, is one of the lead characters. Oh, uh, well, no, no, she's not really. Oh, well, you, you, you'll see. All right, let's just start. I'm, uh, I'm sorry for the de delay, everyone. All right, let's start episode four in sheep's clothing. Bah. Oh, my God. Here we go afford to look human you're going to the farm it's recap i actually forgot what's the what happened idea, kind of forgot what happened uh, in the last episode already oh uh bloody mary that's what happened missing a piece crane must have taken a shard with him the open arms enjoy your stay thanks bigby and thanks for covering for me last time too bigby how could you do this to me I guess Hello. I finally it's Beauty and the Beast. For who you are? Tell me who did it. Just tell me who did it. I know you know. I don't think he did it. What? Look at him. That transition is very funny. This man I I know you know who he did it. I know who you know who did it. BP just went full on werewolf in this uh, in episode three. <laughs> All right, Twilight. You gotta know. Uh, you gotta learn. This is how you make a proper werewolf. I mean. Being a full wolf is nice, but you know. But and that's Bloody Mary. Just take him, okay? Take Crane. Well, this is a big. Oh yeah, that's it. Ah, the bone. I hate seeing that. Mm. The bone ain't great. Seeing the bone ain't great. In with the new. Long live the queen. All right. Um. Yeah. That was a nice recap. Hold up. Okay. Uh, guys, let me, uh, let me know if the game volume is too low or something. Or if my mic's too high. Point bullets are a nasty business. The silver slug deformed and shredded on impact. He'll be okay, though. Hmm? He'll be okay? His internal organs are positively riddled. If I don't extract every single scrap of silver, he's liable to suffer some long term toxicosis. The fuck is toxicosis? Easy there. Try not to move. <laughs> Dead face. Don't worry, he's a big boy. Oh! <laughs> this way, old boy. <laughs> Cannot. This is why I'm not a doctor. Before you were conscious, but there's little I can do for the pain. What? What happened to me? There was. You got lucky, and found yourself in the care of a most skillful surgeon, me. Oh! Be, don't move it. Stop. Oof! Look, I'm a bit. This is why I'm not a doctor. At the moment, but if the fractured extremity concerns him that much. He can set it himself. Let's do it. <laughs> Did I fix it or not? Nope, didn't fix it. I made it worse. Oh, maybe, maybe made it better. Not 
bad. Uh, yeah, it's just a hairline fracture, you know. That's all it was. And he won't be next time if he keeps going like this. He didn't listen to me before. Maybe he'll listen to you. I don't know about that. Well, you should. This. Yeah, this is honestly the job. The job. Quiet. Just relax. Oh God. <laughs> Excuse me, Miss White, but perhaps it'd be better if you gave me a few minutes to finish with him. I, I think I should stay at least until he's out of the woods. No, oh, no, Taylor Swift. Be in better hands, yeah. and I need the space to work. So, don't worry, Snow. I'll be okay. We'll be done in a moment. He'll be fine if he can. If he can, you know, snap his arm back. <laughs> hey, Doc, how much longer? Colin, leave him be. It's finished when it's finished. Cause I once watched a vet sew a turtle together in ten minutes flat. Colin, you're not even okay. supposed to be here right now. Thank you. Oh really? Where am I supposed to be? Could you please not distract the doctor while he has my chest cut open? That, yes, uh, that would be helpful. Does he actually have his chest quite open? That's like more like the. Uh, there. All actually, don't know what this part is called. Great. This isn't a habit you should keep to, having visits with me. And well, this time, this time was no joke. Eat as many metal shellings as you see fit, but take just one more silver round near your heart. And the only place I'll be visiting you is the morgue. He's healing though. Like you can see there's like less blood. I don't know why, but it just it just seems like it. If he can figure out what that means. He knows what it means. It's just been an unusual couple of days. I know, but please don't give him the excuse. His body will eventually give out. Uh -huh. Take care of him, please. Not just his body, his bones, his what, everything. You'll need rest, I assume. Sleep mostly. Just keep watch. Snow has enough to deal with, Swineheart. I can take care of myself. Clearly. Anyways, guard against, as they say. Miss White, Sheriff, Colin, Swiney. If he starts going out again, damn, this guy has big balls. So big balls. No, I, I I want to make a point now that I couldn't. It's big B Snow. He'll be okay. Mm. Hell, I seen him take worse. Don't worry about me, all right? I'll be fine. See, strong as an oak, this guy. Reassurance is always the best thing sometimes. I'm glad you're not dead. Did he wrap up the arm? Oh yeah, he did. Okay. You, uh, you stopped breathing, you know, when you passed out or, or died, I guess. It, um, it kind of scared the hell out of me. I've never seen you like that. And when Swineheart arrived, uh, he's never worried. And even he thought- I'm here for Snow. I'd never leave you. Yeah, He'd be happy. You were really fucked up, man. Okay, this you pig is such like starting to be, you know. And bend its limbs the wrong way. Colin. <laughs> I'm just saying I was worried about him is all. The guy hasn't had a night's rest in days. Well, I'll get some rest when this whole thing is done. What whole thing? What's even happening out there? I mean, do you guys have like a plan or something? And who should I be asking? Should I be worried about the Crooked Man taking over? The Crooked Man, Bloody Mary, the Tweedles. I just... This is bigger than what I... I'm so stupid. I just remember what the Crooked Man was. It... I was like, why is the Crooked Man sound so familiar? Then I just realized that it was... Uh, I heard it from the, yeah. the Conjuring, the apparently. Man came out of the totally forgot about that. For him to attack us so blatantly like that. He either feels invincible or desperate. Well, if those are my two options... I don't think I'd pick desperate. What do you mean? You traded Crane to save Bigby. I'm just saying, that's not exactly something you do when you're playing with house money. So he called my bluff. It's not like I'm gonna let Bloody Mary just murder him. Yeah, uh, thanks, Snow, for all that back there. 
There you go. No problem. Why doesn't Snow notice? You're like, that that's a bit weird. Hoop? Or that the crooked man thinks he's got snow under his thumb. Nah. What else could Snow do? If she didn't hand him over, my ass would be down the witching well. Crane still would have been taken. Okay, okay, I'll take your word for it. All I care about right now is just what does the crooked man want out of this? Yeah, he wants to get to his crooked house or something like that. I don't know. I don't know how the story goes. He's operating in other circles. It can't just be about Crane, right? Getting him out of town? Is this all about the murders? Crane can't be useful to him anymore. So what could this have to do with Faith and Lily? This is about those girls. And it'll always be about those girls. Nothing will change that. We'll see. I actually do want to know what, what is going on. Like, why why did they target the girls? Declared war against us last night. At least that's what I thought when it happened. But now I see this war has been going on for years. We just haven't noticed it because our way of doing things is broken. We need to do things the right way. What does that mean, the right way? Uh, it's in the left think, way. I don't know, but it suspiciously sounds like your way. Look, I know things haven't gone great recently, but we're still doing our best. That's not good enough. So, starting now, we do everything cut and dried. By the book, straight as an arrow. Pure as driven snow. I'm not saying I'm the arbiter of. Sure, you're not. Oh, wait, like, you mean ha they have not been doing it by the book? Monsters. I'm so confused. What happened last night, what you turned into, it can't happen again. Well, I mean, it just can't help it. Hold up. The fight monsters. Colin, if I really believed that we needed him to lose his flippin' mind at a moment's notice, I'll do better. We'll do better. To be honest, yeah, he, I mean, if it, I do, the only reason why he right. turned was because they shot him. Thank you. Right. Look, but that was just that to, to, bring all this to up, add on to his healing factor. So, so it's, like, it's like he's like Wolverine. I'm actually looking at Wolverine in the face right now. I'm playing Wolverine. So for that, you want to give him a handicap? Like the bad guys will worry if shit gets sloppy. Everybody wants Bigby to smile and shave and take a shower now and then. Relax, Con. Can speak for myself. Okay? <laughs> He'll get the job done. Just let him do it. I'm going to. I'm going to let you do it. Okay? It's just that now that I'm deputy mayor, I need your respect. To be honest, yeah, true. And this situation has to end. What situation? All unglamored fables starting today have to go and stay at the. Farm. Oh, give me a fucking break. <laughs> Are you gonna let her talk to me like that? It's been the rule for a reason. Okay, everyone just calm down. Everyone just calm down, all right? I'm perfectly calm. It's so funny that you're I'm asking a pig to go back to the right farm. Now. What's it gonna be, Bigby? Wolf's residence. That's rude. <laughs> Buffkin, what is it? Okay, I'll let him know. Thanks. Guess who's waiting in your office right now? Nerissa. Nerissa? That broad from the pudding and pie? Yes. <laughs> the little mummy? Apparently, she told Buffkin that she has something she needs to talk to you about. But that she'll only tell you. What do you think that could be? Uh, Bigby's got an admirer. You always do well with the... Yeah, she just, she probably just knows franchise. something. She knows something. She's helped me a little with the case. Maybe she has something else. Maybe she does. I should get back to the business office. I've left Buffkin alone for too long taking calls. Hey, what's up, Eugene? I should probably change out of these clothes. Welcome to the stream. Consider the discussion tabled, but not over. Let me know when you're done with Nerissa. Aye, aye, Captain. Colin. She's a piece of work. Busy as hell. Hey, ah, it's alright, dude. Really gonna Take your time. Farm, are you? I mean... <sighs> She seemed real serious about it, but I can still hang out here, right? I don't know. Snow will come around. She's just... You know, the crane thing hit her hard, and she doesn't really know who her friends are right now. Oh, okay. I get it. Don't worry about it. Thanks, Bigby. Uh, yeah, you rem remember that, but then I'm not making any promises, Colin. I nearly, I nearly just say pig. 
Oh, dude, just stick around. You you know when I finish. Wait, that was not his office. Oh, that's just that was his apartment. This is the office. Hello, Narissa. All right. Here's the awesome intro. I want to send to though. It's all right. I mean, just just look. You don't have to like you know. Yeah, it's alright. Just look around, dude. It's fine. It's gonna be a while since until uh, I finish this because this is gonna be like um. Uh, I just this is only episode four, so there's still gonna be like two hours before I've actually done with the move among us. Round two hours. Uh, I'm gonna have a five minute break after this episode, and then I'll uh, then I'll start episode five. Just look around, dude. It's fine. Hi, Sheriff. She actually looks different. I don't know why. Hi, Narissa. Have a seat. Did honestly did not know he has he has an office. I thought that was his office, but that's my bad. I, um, are you okay? You didn't look good last night. Well, let's just say I've been better. <coughs> you really want to smoke after like all the things you just. Oh, that's me, okay. Not many people smoke those. <laughs> So what's bring, oh, what brings here? So what is it you wanted to talk to me about? I know what you did for me, sending me the open arms. And I think you want to help me again. There's not a lot that I can talk about. You know that. So that spell crane was trying to break. It's not just while you're at work, huh? What I mean is, I don't want to waste your time but I don't want you wasting your own time either. What? Back in the dressing room, at the pudding and pie, I told you what I was looking for, and you found a way to tell me. You sent me to the open arms. Maybe that'll work again? You can try. I just... Your lips are sealed. Go ahead. You're here because the crooked man just sent Crane to the bottom of my list of worries. You have something you want to say about that, right? These lips are sealed. Yep, there you go. If I could answer you just like that, I wouldn't have had to make that appointment with you. No, I guess not. Sometimes, we have to find our way through life on our own, grasping and fumbling in the dark. I... I used to have friends to help me find my way, but now they're gone. Is it Sebastian, the uh, lobster? Was it crab? Lobster, crab? Yeah. Are you saying you need a friend right now? You can trust me. What I'm saying is friends matter. And I... I don't have any left. I literally just gave you my friendship. You. So I hope you're looking <sighs> after yours. Are you? It's my job to look out for people, and not just my friends. <sighs> I'm sorry. I thought I could do this. You I barely. No. You you barely to told us anything, and you said I thought I could do this. It's okay. Take your time. I'm sorry if I'm wasting your time. You kind of are. I thought I knew how to say it. Ribbons. Faith wore one too, huh? Do you like it? Hmm? Do you? I'm trying, I'm trying to help. I just yeah. don't know what I can do. That's why you can't tell me anything. 
It's the ribbon, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Can you not just rip it out? Can't we just take the ribbon off? No! Lips are sealed! Whoa! What? You can't! Just stay back! Oh my you god, chill! Do that! Slow down. It's alright. I'm not gonna do anything. Yeah, I just wanna s Please don't. Thank God I didn't. Zop. I have a feeling that if I take it okay. off, I hate just. I get it. Yeah. So the ribbons, if you take them off, the lips are sealed. Probably snow. <laughs> Listen, Sheriff. That arm um, hurts, dude. Do, don't touch. Between us. <sighs> yes. I could be in a lot of trouble. What are you worried about? Just please don't say anything. We haven't. To be honest, we haven't said anything. Sorry. I just need to talk to the sheriff for a moment. Please excuse us. One minute. I might have a new lead for you, but I don't know how solid it is. Beauty and Beast called the office just now. They said they wanted to talk to you about something. I wonder if they've heard about Crane. Thank okay. you for listening, Sheriff. You should go on to your next business. I don't think you'll be wasting your time. No, wait, you don't have to go. Damn, Snow looks so that guilty. That was... abrupt? That's one way to send a message. What did she tell you? I didn't mean to rush her out. Uh, she told me enough. I think she told both of us with the way she just left. Okay then. Good work. Yeah, she, she did stress on the work about, uh, you, sh so you should go or something least, like that, yeah. Do you think there's something to it? Is this the right place to look? What could they know about the Crooked Man? Or do you think they just heard about last night? Well, whatever it is, I'm sure they called for a reason. Suppose I better go check it out. Hmm. Mm-hmm. You know, Beauty came to me a while back. She was looking for... financial assistance. I told her there was nothing I could do, and... and she said that meant she'd have to go somewhere else. Bigby, you don't think she meant that she was going to go to the Crooked Man, do you? Oh my Man, gosh, you're going to be Crooked Beauty. We need to solve this before something else happens. Who knows what? That shot of the elevator is so weird. I don't know why. It just didn't seem right. All right. And you didn't want to tell me what you were into either. Good reason. Look what happened. I'm guessing this is theirs. I don't think this is anything else. Uh, I want to Why? Dude, your arm. Come on. Oh. What do you want? You called us. Oh. Well, you're just going around knocking on doors. You called, right? Or, uh, was it beauty? <laughs> Why would I call you? Listen, I've had a shitty night. Do you think you're the only one? And I really don't want to deal with the runaround. Snow said you called and wanted to talk to me. Well, I didn't call. Must have been Beauty. She's been surprising me a lot lately. <sighs> and I... So have you, Bigby. Yet, with all the sneaking around and secrets, somehow I'm still the bad guy in this. I've had to hear about it all night long from her. Who is it? Who's there? Look, I'm coming in. So, uh, let's not get into busting down doors today, alright? 
he Okay, I thought I was your pal, Big B. Hi, Big B. Please excuse us for just a minute. <laughs> Can I talk to you in private? Yes, let's. Wow. Look at Beauty and the Beast in the background right there. So I really do have the smallest apartment in the woodlands. Holy shit, yeah, you do. You're going to make a problem out of this. What are you doing here? Mm. To bring him Talk about living in the past. Taylor's all this time. And then you run and call him again. That's all I can remember of the song. He was keeping secrets for you. Uh, what was this? Or get it? Is that a flower? Is a flower inside? No. All right. I got cash. Is that a rose? Uh. All right. There's nothing much to do. Want to talk? We'll talk. <sighs> Dude, your arm. Oh, thanks for letting us. Hey, your cousin. Conversation. Hello. Sorry, it's been a long night. Yeah, you know what they say: centuries of marriage come with centuries of baggage. There's, I gotta say, okay. The place, it looks uh, expensive. What do you mean by that? Beast! No, really, I want to know. Nothing. It's a nice place you got here. <laughs> Thanks, but that's really not why I called. Is this something about that loan you took out from the crooked man? Am I joining the place? Hey, you are sick. On our own. Bigby's just going to sick. complicate things. I called him here, and I want to see sick. <laughs> Why are you being like this? I'm just trying to do what's best for us. I'd like to help you, but I can't do anything if you don't tell me what's going on. I gotta know one thing first. What if we did have something to say about the Crooked Man? What if we talk and you don't get him? And all this comes back on us? I mean, risking a lot. We gotta... We've seen what happens when you cross the Crooked Man. I don't know if it's worth it. There are the other people the only know. ones in danger. If you have info on that crooked bastard, I need to hear it. Otherwise, I've got better things to do. No, please don't. <laughs> then tell me what the fuck is going on. Yeah, I'm so confused right now. Dead? Look around you. This isn't the way people short on cash live. <gasps> We're used to a certain kind of lifestyle, okay? Really no we shit, we know. We never meant for it to get like this. It's just that we had nowhere else to turn. Mm, that's a pretty interesting, crazy. <laughs> There's not a lot of work out there. Uh, that is actually a really good um abbreviation. I like that. Hello. Uh, let me just uh. Hey, we're not done yet. And we can't talk should... to the phone right now, so leave a message at the beep and we'll get back to you as soon as... <laughs> Humanly possible. Beep! I thought he was going to say peace. I'm going to come down there and bash your heads in with that machine if I have to call you. <laughs> Alright, they're All not gonna I care about is oh. how can I find the crooked man? Who do I talk to? Where do I go? These two that's where I borrowed the money. The crooked man these two place. I asked for something and they hugged each other. About loans before. So when I needed money. Wait. Who do you deal with? Jersey. You know, the Jersey Devil. Oh yeah. That slimy prick. I didn't realize he was back on this side. Is of the Jersey river. a no town in New Jersey? In and out. Probably dropping to mind you where you stand. That's the table. Never the crooked man. Mainly it's just regular fables. 
Wrong guy, I hate you. It was a mistake, but I'm not the only one who goes there, you know. I saw the woodsman's axe there just the other day. It was in a display case. I guess he's hit hard times, too. There's a lot of that going around. What the hell are you doing hanging out at a place like the Lucky Pawn anyway? Sometimes fables sell things they brought from the homelands. Things you can't find anywhere else. You do know there's a difference between pawning something and selling it, don't you? I... I know that. Do you? A piece you hate someone it. else's misery. With money, you don't have... Well, that's over now. Maybe if you go there, you can sort some things out. I guess I'll go check out the Lucky Pawn. If I can't track down the Crooked Man there, maybe I can make enough noise that the Crooked Man will come find me. Hold on, Bigby. Don't go there. Sounds like you're just going to get Beauty in trouble. And... And... I hate you know this too. Shop, the cut above. It's the I don't like this two couple. <laughs> I, like, I don't like Sue. Baker and the candlestick maker. Well, I've been delivering packages from there for a while. The thing is, it's for the crooked man. And I don't think it's meat in the packages. You, you gotta understand, I need it work. Well, what are you delivering? What's going on there? How does this fit into the crooked Oh my god, I'm gonna choose whether to go to the cut above or the lucky pawn, right? It's the All right. meat market in town. Seuss, Seuss Lita's fish. How much actual butchery goes on there? How did you get involved with this? Johan the butcher called. He had a problem with the refrigeration unit. One Later. Day. But when I finished, it was your pal Mary. See your fish. Pay me. She said I was reliable. She liked that. And it's the only thing I've been able to pick up. And it's still not enough. It's Mary you deal with? Bloody Mary is there? No, Johan is the one who hands over the packages, you know, day to day. But I've seen her around there. She gets under my skin, you know. I, I try to avoid her. Wow, but a woman got under she's this guy's right skin. You don't. I don't need a rundown on her reputation. Mary works out of there. I need to look into it. I just wanted to provide for beauty. Give her the kind of life she deserves. We shouldn't have to live like this. Scraping to get by. None of us should. What we are this? royalty once. We were accustomed oh my to God. a certain lifestyle. I just realized what I'm looking at. This place I'm looking at Trump life. and uh You wouldn't understand me. And Leah. <laughs> no. I I don't know. Probably not. So, where are you going? If this all goes sideways, I'd like to know where it's coming from. Mm. <sighs> so like if you want a butcher shop, butcher shop, you can get the Bloody Mary, which you can use the thing. Butcher shop, I'm so sorry. You know that butcher shop, the cut above? The thing is, I don't think it's meat in the packages. You know that butcher shop, the cut of them. The Lucky Pawn. That's where I borrowed the money. The Crooked Man's behind that place. All right. The Lucky Pawn. <sighs> that's where I borrowed the money. Okay, this is... The Crooked Man's behind that place. All right. The Lucky One... Pawn. Okay, that's, that's irritating. Okay, so the butcher shop gets me to Bloody Mary. But this is to the Crooked Man. Which is both kind of the same way. The Crooked Man's behind that. Fuck it, we're going Lucky Pond. I'm going to the Lucky Pond. There's too much going on there to ignore. I'll have a word or two with Jersey. You know, Bigby, once you show your face there, word is going to get out. There may be nothing left to see if you go to the butcher shop after. Well, I guess I'll find out. Wait, I don't know what you're planning to do when you find the crooked man, but is there any way you could help us out? But give my shitty apartment to you? What do you mean? <laughs> well, maybe you can make this all just go away. We would really appreciate it. What, what the hell? Can you help us out? 
You're asking me to kill him, aren't you? Is that what you think I do? Uh, no, of course not. You I don't know how you get that idea. We just, we know that the crooked man is dangerous. To all of Fable. You guys are giving me the suspicious eyes. <laughs> you, that might just solve your problems anyway. Oh, thank you, Big B. I'm sure you'll do the right thing. Both of you will give you the shifty eyes. What are you think that you don't? Oh my god. This couple are a pain in my ass. Love their story though. It's dirty. Disney was good. Note. But no. It looks like you slept in it. In a pile of garbage. Tech, why are you oh I'm god, is this frog again? For a yeah, but I also got her phone number. I don't want your phone number. Ugh, really? Whoa. Big B's here. Oh. This is a surprise. I'm just here for information. It's about the murders. This will take two minutes and I'll be out your way. I'm not taking the coat. But it's magic. <laughs> so? And it'll be covering a check I already wrote. Okay, well, that sounds like a your problem problem to me. Hey, oh my god, he stole my line. That's not face coat. It was face coat. Look, you left it in my place. What do you expect me to do? Yes, I think the off-sighted statute of finders keepers clearly states that it's his now, Bigby. So what's it really? Going to be? You're gonna go with the finders keepers thing? I don't know what to tell you. See if Cindy needs a coat. I, I don't know. <sighs> is this Cindy? This is Miss Cinderella? Bloody glamours, you know. You and your blinking rules. Give me a break, Toad. This is your own damn fault. Yeah. You buy a car, but you don't save money for this. And what happened to that car, right? Huh? Let's talk about that. Smashed to a tin can because you had to play rough with the woodsman. I don't know what you're getting so steamed about. Shouldn't be that big of a shock that I'm not going to take an ass hair coat. No. Ass hair coat. Bleeding operations just to set up for one of his shady fucking loans. Ixnay on the own lays. Okay, Og Frey. I mean, what kind of a game are you running in? I know who you're talking about. <laughs> Oops. Um, Ogfrey? The crook, <laughs> right? <laughs> this is his place. Those are his loans. Well, I'll leave you to your business. I'm sure you'll have a lot to talk about. That Good looks really that heavy for, for a donkey off. coat. Leave the coat. How the hell do you expect me to get a glamour then? It's not like I've got a lot of options, you know. <sighs> Fine. Oh, look, I'll... I'll give you some money, all right? You've got to be kidding me. Do you even know how much a glamour costs? I've... I've never had to buy one. Keep your money, Sheriff. I've no patience for charity. If you're gonna be out like this, can't you at least wear a bigger hat? Oh yes, no? please do. No, that looks business. really stupid. Between what? Between the business office and fables like a crooked man. Who you purportedly seek to protect us from. Either way, I'm getting screwed. Drop by any time. Look, I'm sorry, all right? What else do you want from me? He really grows on you. <laughs> Look, I work here sometimes for the extra cash. It's something stable. All right. You know, between more... They went from the farm to stables. So I'm, ask, I'm just I've imagining Charlotte's web. I don't know why. That. In fact, as far as I can tell, he's never even actually stepped foot in here. But Bloody Mary works for him. And the last time I saw her, she had the woodsman's axe. All right, I'm going to pause there for a while because I am getting a bit hungry. So uh, I'm, let me go get a small snack. I'll be our
Jeez, I'm back. I'm back. I'm I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. 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 I'm back. All right. Sorry, that took a bit longer. Uh, the reason why is uh, my mom ran into some TV trouble, but it's fine. Uh, yeah, let's talk. So, so, oh, before we end, I have on the ends, so I'm gonna mute myself. So, the, actually, no, it's actually not that crumpy. So yeah, it's pretty fine. Last time anybody else saw that axe, it was here. We'd never take something like that. Is this really why you came down here? The woodsman's axe? Yeah, it's why I came down here. It'll lead me right to the Crooked Man if I can track it. He's been sending people to kill me. And I'd like to have a little chat about that. Was the axe here? No. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. I think it I seems like he's asking a question. Something. Since, you know, I can sometimes miss the obvious. You wouldn't mind if I look around for a bit then. And what if I did mind? Uh, got it. Listen, hmm. I gotta start closing up shop, so uh close. It's the middle of the day. What can I That's say? day. Jersey <laughs> likes to run at odd hours. And really, he'd be the one to talk to, so can't you just swing by later? It really wouldn't be good for me if he sees your face when he walks in. So uh I wanna check stuff out here first. This is a crooked man place, maybe something here'll help me find him. Can't you Shut just up, Jack? The Jersey Devil isn't here to answer my questions. It also means he isn't here to get in my way. So I'm gonna take a look around. As long as I've got the elbow room. All right. Don't let me get in your way. I won't. All right. Odd price. Uh, odd things, Christopher, because it's big. It's big. It's... What was that? It looks empty. Jack is such a liar. I thought you said you'd never take something like this. Uh, uh, what? I, I, do, I don't, uh... Jack? Uh, yeah? When was Mary here? <laughs> was who here? Bloody Mary. Because the axe was here. But it's gone. And she had it. So she was here. I don't know anything about that. I don't. Really. I mean, I don't work every day, so... Uh... Just tell me the truth. What happened to the axe? It was Mary. She took it, okay? That's all I know. That's all you know? You don't know she almost fucking killed me with it last night? No. No. I had no goddamn idea. She say anything about... About the crooked man's plans. About Crane. The lighting on his face is really weird, friends? though. I try not to even look that crazy chick in the eye. Well, for your sake, you better think of something to tell me. That's all I can tell you. I'm being straight here. I'm just part-time. I mean, it's Jersey who's the one who's into this stuff. He's one of the crooked man's boys, okay? And it'd be great if he was here to tell you all this, but he's not. So just... Jersey, don't... don't give me that shit. What the fuck is the point of having a system if you're just gonna... That's my fucking system. Oh. You... Here you go, Woodsman again. I'm the guy to keep shit in order, and that's it, Woody. Who closed the fucking gate? Jack? <laughs> If you love your axe so fucking much, why'd you pawn it in the first fucking place, huh? I didn't pawn it, asshole. It was stolen from my apartment. And Grant said that he saw it here. Woody, calm down. Your axe isn't here. Christ. And this fucking guy, too? Bigby. What? It isn't? Nope. It isn't. Just Jersey like looks said, like Stanley. Happy? If he was a ginger. I got shit to do, so whatever you're here for, make it snap. Uh, he wanted to know where... Actually, you know what? I don't care what he wants. You work with the crooked man. And until I give you permission, you're not gonna do anything but answer my questions. Uh, how's your arm? Bloody Mary leaves a bit of a stink, don't she? Jack, did you know that as of this very morning, Bigby's joined the crooked man's obedience school for wayward fucking creatures? He's already passed his first class. You see... The sheriff had who he stupidly thought was the murderer. Been chasing him for fucking days, right? But the crooked man snapped his bony fingers. And Bigby handed him over. Just like that. I'm, uh, just gonna, uh, let you two, you know, 
Tell me everything you know right now about the murders and the crooked man. What the hell is Jack doing? Are you kidding me? It was here. It was right fucking here. What did you do with it? How the fuck do I know? Listen, you bald little dipshit. You're gonna. Whoa, what you the hell? Back it up, Jersey. You're dealing with me now. I didn't expect to see you upright. Still looking for whoever killed them hookers? The reason why I spot Woody because Woody actually does his axe. Who'd you give it to? Trust me, you do not want to go there. And what if I do? You talk big, but I don't think you got the stones to back it up. Oh! Still a little sore, are we? That asshole. You ain't so tough. Uh, yep, I'm gonna go there. You're gonna get the pins. Yep, that's what you get. This is my fucking fun. Not now. You got a lot of nerve. That is one hell of a devil. Oh, yes. Is that a, is that, that's the X. Too bad you couldn't protect those whores. <laughs> Go on, try to stop me. Yeah, yo. There she is. Yep. I'm trying to hit you. Oh, shit. Nope, you're not gonna hit me. I've got too much injuries. Stop. No. Nope. This guy's just a bit horny, that's all. Did that? Did, was it, did he say fuck you? Is the best thing. Yep. So comical. It has to be. in the bends and forks of tree roots behind the sun in the <coughs> shadows that's not good enough. oh the door to his house it bounces around never in one spot you'll never find it even crane had to use the magic mirror that fucking guy <laughs> convince me that i should trust you would this face lie to you? That's a face. You don't know anything about anything, do you? What do you have? Nothing. Had ah, useless bitch Snow White in a broken fucking mirror. Nothing? I still have you, don't I? It doesn't matter what you fucking do. You're not gonna get him. You wanna knock on his fucking door and see what happens? Fine. Crane had the mirror. Bloody Mary had Crane. So take your fucking wrecking crew act to the butcher shop. The cut above. If I can find the mirror piece there, I can find the crooked man. That's her spot. 
That's where all the magic happens. So I should have actually gone there, but at least I now wouldn't have here. this amazing so I can find fight master. sequence. Oh my god, you can see his brain. You better not be fucking with me, or I'll come back here and finish the job. I'm guessing that's a yes. You got what you want. Now get the fuck out of here. Hey, Sheriff. Those girls are still dead. Oh, and there's nothing you can do to bring them back. And I don't know what they did, but I do know this. Yeah, shut the fuck up, will ya? It's just he went too much. He went too far. Out of smoke. Yeah, sure, why not? Yeah, he helped me out, so why not? Oh my god! What a stupid thing is just like down here. Some Good bitch. Sir. Oh! Sorry, you guys have to hear this. You're welcome. I'm not gonna lie. I was having trouble deciding which one of you to hit with this thing. Jersey was wrong. About what? About those girls. There is something we can do about it. And get the fucker who did it. Ain't that the plan? Yeah. You're damn right it is. Alright. Go do it then. <laughs> Episode 1, I brawled with this guy. And now, like, he's like my best friend. <laughs> Hey, Woody. Yeah. I'll see you around, all right? Yeah. I'll see ya. Fingers. Should have been here first. That's all, sorry. Respect, man. Gotta respect the signs. I mean, there's literally nothing. Well, what kind of service is this? I went to the butcher shop and there's no meat. There's, oh, there is meat. Alright, never mind. Uh, try. Let's ring the bell. Ring my bell. Put your shop. Big B Wolf? Really? Who else it is? What happened to you? I'm looking for a piece of the magic mirror. Um, wh what? The magic <laughs> mirror's missing shard. Where is it? Bloody Mary brought it here, didn't she? What? Bloody Mary? Magic mirror shard? <laughs> what kind of place do you think this is? Don't bullshit me. I'm not. What you're looking for, I I think you'd be better off looking at uh, the Lucky Pond. Yeah, or someplace like that. You know where it is, right? It's around the I'm corner and a few out. blocks down. I'm gonna take a look around. You don't mind. I... Sheriff, I... Did you hear that? What? Oh, I'm real sorry. Most Hold stupid on. thing I, I ever. Go check on that. that asshole Don't just press in right an alert button. Sure. I didn't just him. have to go see. Yep. Asshole just press an alert button. Shit. Yep. Oh my god, there's a lot of meat. Is it cold? Yep, it's cold. You can see too. Right 
Is that blood? Okay, I've had enough of this shit, Johan. Come on out. Just wait in the front. I'll be right out. I'm sorry, Sheriff, but you're not supposed to be back here for uh, safety purposes. Come on, damn it. You're such an innocent guy, you're acting pretty damn strange, <laughs> Johan. I don't know what to tell you. Oh, you got to be kidding me. They're gonna kill me. Oh, God, she is gonna fucking kill me. What the hell? He's gonna get me killed. Use your legs to lift, not your back. Huh? You'll get hurt that way. Now, what the hell are you doing? Please, please, Bigby. Please don't. Bigby? What happened to Sheriff? Please don't kill me, Sheriff. <laughs> I don't want to die. Please, please don't kill me. You don't talk, I might have to do just that. Is that what you want, Johan? No, no, please. You don't have to do that. Okay. I'm dead. Either way, they said to me, Johan, you could keep your life and lose your shop or lose both. What would you do? It, it was a simple choice to make in the moment. Just open the door, Johan. It won't be your problem anymore. I, I can't. Why not? What's your lips are sealed? There? I don't know. Oh no, okay, what? he doesn't have the ribbon. I, I've never been back there. It's locked from the other side. Look, I, I just worked the front. That's all I'm supposed to do. So you are a part of this. You've been bullshitting me this whole time. I've already asked That is so, so close to his face. Myself. He's just too There's close to his face. Mirror shard. So help me, I will put your head through that damn door. Tell me what I need to know, now. I don't know. I'm not part of their crew. Crew, the crooked man's people, Jersey Devil, the crooked the man's crew, mental case, Bloody Mary. Y you want to talk about the? It should be called the crooked. It's her, not me. This is her place. I'm telling you, they muscled in on me, took over my storage and delivery a long time ago. All cause of that heat wave. That summer was even hotter than this one. Oh, I let Mary in those. Porkers stay cool in the meat locker one day, playing cards, having a great time. I guess they were sizing the place up. Shows what I get for being nice. I'm just a victim in this. I don't know what they do back there. I swear. And, and I don't Victim. Want to... Okay. Well, yeah, we're sure. About why not? To see what's back there. And then we'll see if I believe you. All I right. knew this would happen. Didn't know what. Shh. Didn't hear anything. Time to open it up. I uh, kind of guess I have to do this. See. All right. The hell? Okay, I thought that was someone else's shadow inside. It's just Johan. Tongue of dog. Ew. Run. He pressed the button, didn't he? Like for soil, swine snout, those bit. The hell is going on here? What is this place? I told you, Big P. I don't know. They muscled me out. I swear, I don't know anything more. I haven't been back here when it was like this. Warning lights. This business. It's all I've ever had. Damn it. You can't act like you're forced into this and then turn around and help them. They'd still be here if you hadn't flipped that switch out there. I had to. Huh. You come in here making trouble for me. But you only give a shit now because the crooked man stepped on your toes or something. Where were you when they took this place from me? It hasn't been easy for me. You, you think I want to live with this at my back? I needed help. Well, I'm here now. I'm gonna sort this all out. Yeah. Oh, and do we, do we have to search every single thing? All right. Got some glamours. So this is what Beast was delivering. Glamours. Other kinds of magic. Could be dangerous stuff. What's, what's with the shackles? Jeez. Who's getting chained up here? 
You can't think I'm the only one the crooked man has under his yoke. Is this what those loans get you? That crooked piece of shit. Ribbons, chains, it's... it's all the fucking same. Hmm. Let's look at the jaws. These are raw materials for making magic. Anti-greenleaf and any other rogue witches out there probably get their supplies here. Nose? Is that, does that say nosebleed? Really? Can't just say blood. Too bad they had time to erase it all. This could have been useful. Maybe just don't. Wow, they really erased it all. I'm guessing it's a formula. Uh, what's this? That symbol. It's on all the packages. What is it? That's the crooked man's uh, brand. It's on everything that goes in and out of here. So you do know something, huh? Is that a, a wheel or what? Guess they never used that thing on wolves, huh? What's that supposed to mean? It's from back in the homelands. A torture device. It came over here with the rest of our stories. What? It's not that Mondays need any help coming up with that kind of thing. It makes people crooked. By breaking their bones and... Do I really need to explain this? Yeah, that's just crooked, man. What are they making here? I'm just a butcher. You want to talk T-bones? <laughs> that I can do. This stuff is out of my league. There are a lot of nasty spells you can make with the right equipment. What the hell is that? The shit is that? Is that a coat? I know this isn't your coat. What's it doing here? It's a coat. What's the big deal about some dirty... Looks like Crane's seen some abuse. I'm sure he has that Crane's coat? Fine. No time for traveler's checks, huh? Eh. Let's take the money. He won't be needing this anymore. <laughs> now, you never know when the money's useful, you know. That sick piece of... Yep, this is definitely Crane's coat. I don't remember him wearing a purple coat. Shard. Look, the shard. Shard. Finally. Hey, hold on. Well, I'm real happy you found what you're looking for, Bigby. But what about me? Huh? What the hell am I supposed to do now? I'm going to have to spend the rest of my short life looking over my shoulder for Bloody Mary. You won't have to worry, Johan. I'm going to take him down. Thank you. Thank you, Sheriff. That... <laughs> He's not smoking in a meat freezer, right? This he literally is... This is basically smoked meat now. Everyone's going to be served smoked meat. I guess Johan is just. I guess Johan is just like a normal human-ish guy. Not not human, but yeah, you get you I get what I mean. I don't care who killed the prostitutes. If Crane was helping himself to the community coffers, it means his hand was in my pocket, and you just let him go. I don't know what you heard, but it didn't happen like that. Are you uh, denying the facts? She's denying me the chance to get a word in. Now, Miss White, I Sheriff Bigby has returned. Ah, there's the old wrecking ball himself. Bigby. Where have you been? I'm not finished here, Miss White. You will have to wait. <laughs> Just one moment, please. What Do you found? Seems your dog wants a biscuit. Oh, I'm not in the mood. And you've got a lot Asshole. to answer for. <sighs> oh, really? Buffkin, get this piece in the mirror right away. With pleasure, Miss White. <sighs> that looks like a really small Bigby piece for the, the, the right big direction. missing. Good work, Bigby. You've been gone all day. What did you uncover? I thought you were going to report back to me. 
I mean, it's fine. Uh, so what else did you find out? Once the mirror's fixed, we can use it to find that crooked bastard. Or at least wherever he hangs his hat. That's how Crane kept tabs on him. And everybody else. I'd say he was abusing the privilege. He was probably spying on all of us. He was probably spying on me. Anyway... No, it's fine. You did... You. Excellent work, Bigby. Sheriff, I could use your assistance. Would you join me at the mirror? Will do. I mean, I'm okay with puzzles. Go far, Sheriff. I'd like to have a few words of my own with you. Why don't you go fuck off until <laughs> I'm good and ready? <laughs> I don't understand. This piece just doesn't want to join the rest. Do you have any idea why? Got me. Well, where did you find it? What has it gone through since being separated from the rest? Shattering is a very traumatic experience, you know. Crane was carrying it. For part of the night, at least. I found it in his cup. It's uh, pretty amazing it's still intact after the fight, the kidnapping, and then riding around with Bloody Mary for an hour. Uh, yes, Miss White was asking about her. That explains it. You know who and the mirror have a very unhappy history with each other. How would you like it if she tried to use you as a doorway? I think I already know the feeling. Well, I think I know how to... Oh my god. I'm still not used to that. <laughs> ah, never, I'm never used to that sound. <laughs> that actually freaks me out. Hey, I'll go with a resubscribe for seven months. What's up, man? <laughs> I, I honestly thought that was part of the whole like the <laughs> the <this, this> show. <laughs> oh my god. Science <sighs> bitch. He might not want to come out with you watching. Oh, he doesn't like being spied on. <laughs> Thank you for the seven months, bro. Is it fixed? Did you ask about the crooked man? Buffkin's still working on it. He said it might be a while. If you're so self-reliant, what do you want from the business office so bad? What I want is my business. I can't okay. take those two right now. No one can. We're trying to catch a murderer, and they're... They're over there bickering about bureaucracy. We're at war. Don't they realize that? Is he talking, but his mouth is not moving? Yeah, Frog. thanks. Go talk to Toad. But just so you know, we can't pay him. I technically he really can. Needs to go to the farm, you know. So just break the news and be done with it, okay? All right, I'm just gonna listen to Snow. I'm just gonna break the news. Toad, come here. I thought I made myself very Ribbit. I see how it is. I stuck to an underling, eh? Why am I not surprised? Well, you did cause what damage brings me in here, so maybe it's for the best. Just need a little bit of dosh to cover it. Dosh. Try talking to her about it, but it's like chatting up a brick wall. It is. Now I'm sure you got your own agenda, Sheriff. But I've taken a real wallet because of you. Uh, to be honest, I did try to pay you. Money back at the lucky pawn, but you wouldn't take it. I was just being polite. Ever heard of it? That wouldn't have covered the cab ride home, let alone a glamour. Please, I'm not looking for any more than to cover the big ticket damages, not a cent more. I'm not looking for a handout. Just what's right. Look, I don't write the checks around here, but I know I had a hand in it, so I'll try to get Snow to take care of you. Please do. It's the only way I'll be able to get me close. Tomorrow I should have given him the money. Damn it. This isn't exactly a new problem with you, Toad. You know that if you're out of glamour, I gotta send you to the farm. Well, how about your friend the pig? Hmm? Is he going to the farm too? Yeah, you thought we didn't know about him. This honestly, I'm not of your sir. business. Yeah. You should worry about your own fucking situation, Toad. Bastard. I mean, so did tell me not no, no, give him money, so I'm not going to give him money. If you give me one more chance and hear me out, I'll see a way for me and me boy to stay. I'm not going to ask for any more than I need. I just want to stay. So what do you say? You just give me enough to cover me glamours and we'll call the rest a wash. A wash. Don't take TJ from the only army knows. He's so glamour rules. Oppressive. I've done nothing wrong, but look different. Hey, 
You've been out of glamour from the word go. I have no choice. You and TJ are going to the farm. There's a truck leaving tomorrow. I think you better go break it to your boy. Big B. Look, the damages might be a valid complaint, but that's a separate deal. Waylon Smith can see to that. At the farm. You're a real friend of the people, Sheriff. What a crook of shite. Government by the fables for the fables, my ass. I mean, he has no choice. I'm not going to give him money just so he can. Bluebeard, you want to talk? Now's your chance. I've just made my donation funding this office. So direct your questions to Miss White. Well, at least he's not trying to get rid of me. He's not? For now. Did you take care of Toad? I mean, I saw the way he left. I know it may not seem that important right now, but glamours are the law for a very good reason. I did it. He'll be gone tomorrow. Him and TJ. Hmm. It may not have felt good, but it was the right thing to do. You know that. I know I should be asking how it got like this, but I just keep wondering why it happened to Faith and Lily. You've seen his world. Do you have any idea why he'd want them dead? I don't know if the crooked man killed them with his own hand or... It's honestly just about control. He just wants power, isn't it? If there's one thing I've figured out, it's that the crooked man is all about control. It's what he does with the loans at the pawn shop. The magic he peddles. Chains. Ribbons. Maybe Faith and Lily weren't doing what they were told. Maybe their lips weren't Maybe sealed. Trying to leave. Sheriff! Miss White! I believe the mirror is repaired. How do you... You just said you couldn't repair. Okay, say, doesn't matter. I have been better, but thanks for putting me back together. I'm sorry. I just, I have to know. Mirror, mirror, we're glad you weren't slain. Now please show us that sick creep crane. Wow, nice rhyme. Yeah, I want to see where he's ended up too. To be honest, I actually would want to see what actually happened to Crane. Because you just found it. You will get on that plane to Paris, and you will wait for the day the crooked man needs you. Until then, not a peep. Otherwise, I get to deal with you my way. So please, please disobey. Wait a minute. Someone's watching. How does she know? What? just happened we pointed you in the wrong direction and looked at bloody mary's reflection oh her that explains uh... the sting i'd rather not have to feel the pain she brings oh okay well so, yeah i get let's i get it not do that again okay looks like we'll have to track him down later you're right we need to focus on the immediate threat and that's the crooked man <laughs> big B. We don't have a lot of time. Just show me where I can find the crooked man. I haven't been feeling well of late. Seems neither of us can cooperate. <laughs> Damn. Perhaps I can be of assistance? <clears throat> mirror, mirror, keep us sane. Show the door to crooked man's domain. I can nice. always count on you, Buffkin. I don't recognize the door, but that's the crooked man's symbol on it. Hold on. Oh. Isn't that the there? It moves. Yeah, That's right. Jersey mentioned that. Hey. Wait a minute. I came back. I know that door. That's Central Park. I don't know when it's going to move again, but I'm going to get there before it does. Big B, wait. When you get the crooked man, make sure you bring him back alive. He has to stand trial. We can't just dispense Street justice. I know that emotions can run high, and you have your reasons to handle this. Fine, I'll bring him back alive. I do want to kill him, though. But bring him back here, alive, and we can clean him and cook him together. Good. I have enough to worry about here while I prepare the case against him. So I'm going to trust you to handle this properly. That is, if you think you're ready. Of course, I'm ready. I got no other choice. Hey, I came. I came. It's still very far till we play Siege, so we've still, we still got one more episode after this. Gonna take a five minute break after this episode ends to uh, maybe get a drink, just stretch a bit.
and then we'll start the fifth episode immediately. Mm, kick it down. Ooh, that's nice. Hey, Lape, thank you for the water redeem. Uh, give me a second. My water is like, like down there on my, on 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 my floor, so I'll get it in a bit. That is Tim. What the what hell is Tim doing here? Good evening, Sheriff. I'm here to take you to the boss. Gonna watch me for leaving off Tiny. Tiny Tim. What's Tim? I have uh, to go with me in a previous session. Yeah, yeah, sure, 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 sure. Door. I wasn't sure what to expect when you came through that portal. Hold on. How's it? 36 day? Not bad. Uh, just now I did a test on uh, D2. It's not, it's not bad. But I don't know why um, Streamlabs OBS uh, is not detecting the the game. I have to do it by window capture. I don't know why. I don't think it's a, the 3060. It's something else. the one thing I have to do. Fine. Lead on. This dude doesn't, doesn't link up. Link or like all these. Thanks for understanding. This is all I'm here to do, and I don't want to mess it up. <laughs> I know I'm probably the last person you'd expect to be. Uh, you have to use him. Like, be working here. you know who this guy is. Uh, I, yeah, I don't know why. It just doesn't seem to work. Like, I tried. Uh, I have to like use it as a window capture, right? Not, 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 not display capture. Window capture rather like. than a typical PC capture. He gave the, me a job, and I'm lucky to have it. This is the only option I've got. Just keep that in mind, maybe, because if you and the boss go up against each other, the rest of Fable Town is gonna get caught in the middle. I understand the position you're in, but you don't have to do this. There are other things you could do. So it's just that easy. Maybe not, but you don't want to be a part of this. A lot of us depend on him. Some of us never get to the front of the line at the business office. But he's there. We need you, but we need him too. What we don't need is a war. That is true. Hey, Sheriff, hold up. <laughs> I gotta go in with you. Can't you just wait up, Sheriff? I wait for him. I feel. I feel. I feel really sad. Thanks. I think it's Windows full screen. Uh, Go ahead. I'll, I don't know. I'll, I'll. 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 I'll take a look. I'll let you know. Hey, welcome back. Oh, legit shit is the same people. All these assholes. Oh no, Jersey, don't you dare. Thank you, Tim. I know the sheriff isn't the. That's the crooked man. Oh my god, he really does look crooked. You did well. You can go now. Thank you, sir. <laughs> ah, okay. I'll take a look. Everyone in favor. Let me know. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll update you. You just have to pay attention to what they need to help them find it. Why don't you have a seat, Sheriff? We have a great deal to discuss. No. You're coming with me. It's over. You're alive. You're coming with me. Why was that an intense scene to light a smoke? <laughs> it's, well, that's a very weird way to end the episode, but I think that should be the ending of the episode. Yeah. All right. Let's see what's next time. I've heard stories about you. Oh, bloody Mary again. In the old days, how you picked off those men one by one. Oh, how they screamed. The wolf is coming. And they would wait. Hiding anywhere they could squeeze their pathetic, shivering corpses. Some would just drop to their knees where they stood, close their eyes, and wait for death. And you'd give it to them. <laughs> I wish I could have seen it. Oh well. 
Wow. One more episode and that all that happened. Uh, do you send Collins to farm? Yep, did not send not to send. Try not to. Yep, I, I mean, why would you want to try to remove a ribbon? Wow, no, not, not a lot. A lot of people went to uh, to the butcher shop first. Damn. I had to follow. To bring him in. Mm, not bad. Oh my god, that was loud. Okay. Alright. That is the end of the episode. Well, that was not a bad episode. I just didn't... The ending was a bit weird though. You just ended on a... Yeah, I don't know. It just felt really weird ending. Uh, hold on, let me just answer a few messages first. I'll be looking, I can hear you if you need me. Yeah, sure, sure, sure. No worries. Uh, yeah, I've just been playing uh, one more episode of... Ah, uh... uh, yeah, yeah. No worries. I'll be playing one more episode of uh, Wolf Among Us, the last episode. And then we'll most likely head to Siege. Um, Hakim and Eugene, if you guys can... Uh, if you guys are still there. Can you help me check if the SI... One of you. Doesn't matter which one. Uh, help me check if the SI event is on. If it's on, then... Uh, yeah, I will... We can... We will stop playing uh, after I finish the last episode. Um, if it's not, let me know. Just, uh, just uh, come back to chat and just let me know. Because I really do want to play the SI event, so you guys can get drops. Everyone can get drops. It'd be really fun. I forgot that the the, the credits are really wrong. But I am doing this so that all their names can be appreciated, even though you cannot really see the names that's blocked by my camera over here. But it's fine. These people should get credited. I saw Harley Quinn. Why did I see Harley Quinn? <laughs> I mean, it's Warner Bros, so. Alright, um. Is that the end of the episode? End the episode? That is, that's the end of, of the episode. Alright. Okay, that is the end of the episode, guys. Uh, uh for, for YouTube, sorry. YouTube, thank you. So, we're going to start episode 5 in just a bit. You guys can just skip to the next video for episode 5. I'll catch you guys later. Peace out, YouTube. Hey guys, hope you enjoyed the video and if you do, do hit the like and subscribe buttons right below there and don't forget, I do stream on Twitch every Thursday and Sunday around 8.30pm Singapore time. Link is in the description right below along with my social media. Stay fresh.